What is up, y'all? I'm, I'm just going to keep this short here and play this demo for you. So the way I have this set up, I have my synth going into insert one, which is then routed through two, three, and four here. They're all going into four, so four is my mix bus. Now I have my reverb on insert two, my delay on three, which is then being piped into the mix bus as well as the reverb, which that's the key right there. Because that delay, <coughs> along with the synth going into its own separate separate reverb and then the delay going to the reverb also sort of helps to reinforce the this or I should say sustain of the of the sound itself so I'm going to turn off the synth and the delay here or the, I should say the delay going into the main mix and then we'll just listen to what it sounds like the reverb sounds like Now if I turn off the delay in, in the reverb itself, it's still, you still hear it, but it's just, to me it doesn't sound as full as it could. So that's sort of my little, I, I suppose, trick to keeping things in keeping it full and you, you can do this with you, you can do that with a pad put a pad in its on its own insert so that you can manipulate the reverb separately which I know with older FL studio versions it, they had four sins but there were only four sins for the entire mixer and that for how I do things I, I can't do it that way so I'm hoping, you know, if you have any questions or if uh, you want to see some other tricks that I have that might re relate to it, just let me know. Thanks for watching.